Let's talk today about slugs, margins, bleeds, and what are they and why should you care when you're setting up your Adobe InDesign file when you say file new and it has all these options. Which one should you choose and why does it matter? Hi everyone, I'm Lisa from Pretty Fabulous and I help online businesses create pretty pages using Adobe InDesign and Canva. So if this sounds like you or something you might be interested in, make sure to hit the subscribe button below. I post new videos every Tuesday or extra videos like today. In this file, you see right here, everything from the dotted line inside gets printed on a piece of paper. Everything outside of that is just there for the printer. So question number one, who should care about this and who shouldn't? I always say ignore all these things because one, I do not have a printer that does a full bleed. My pages don't print to the edge. There's an artificial kind of magic margin. You know what I'm talking about? And it's just white space. My printer's just not going to go that far out. Now, if you have a full bleed printer or you are sending this to a professional printer who can do a full bleed, then yeah, you would go ahead and add a bleed for the printer. Usually that's an eighth of an inch. Now, what is a slug? A slug is this extra space, and this is really only if you work in a magazine or at a newspaper where I can like write notes to somebody so I can send it back to the designer or the layout person or the person who wrote the article with all of my notes on it. Or I'll just put a name for the top of this, like this is the features article. So that's all that is that has really nothing to do with you who works alone or if you're sending this out to a printer to be printed they don't really need that you're not like a team working together to do a magazine or newspaper layout so what are the dotted lines here and why would i care about margins so for me margins are just a kind of just reminder of how i'm getting close to the edge because sometimes if you put designs a little too close to the edge and you don't have a full bleed print or even if you do sometimes they get cut off depending on the printer so it's kind of just like a margin of error just to let you know how close you're getting to the edge for a design so if you are printing this at home or you're creating printables for other people I would just assume nobody has a full bleed printer. It's just too difficult to explain. So just make sure all of your designs stay within or very close to those margins. And I always like to use a half inch margin. And again, if you're going to send something to a professional printer, then go ahead and use the bleed and don't worry about ever bothering with the slug. So. Hope that was helpful. Remember, if you would like to create your own planner, make sure to sign up for my free course, Planner 101. I will leave a link to that below. I hope everyone's having a fabulous day and I will talk to you later. Bye.